It's pandemic. If you are watching this video from a hopefully better and happier future, then to put you in perspective, this is still 2020, lockdown number two, the sequel. I'm CK and welcome back to my new daily videos. And why is it daily? You see, back in the days to become a daily vlogger or a daily content creator was like a fashion. And then for some people it became a profession. There are some big names in this pile, like Roman Atwood, Casey Neistat, Fun for Louis, John Olson, I mean, you get it, there are a lot. And if you're asking why was this option so popular, well, well, because what they did is they uploaded their video diary on YouTube. And the end result of watching these personal clips is that the audience started to feel that they are probably their best friends. And is this why I'm starting this challenge? Ah, uh, no. But was daily vlogging a really good way to build a career? And this is another good question, because especially now in 2020, when every single day something happens, you will need to post a, hey, I'm still alive post every day. This is the way how you keep your fans and subscribers engaged. On the other hand, millions of consistent views were really convenient for YouTube too. So what we saw is that the algorithm started to push all creators who were uploading daily. But slow down, put your camera back, because this is all the past. Recently, after some creators did a study and they realized that daily upload is not pushing up your numbers anymore, I can clearly say that finally quality is overriding the quantity. And with this we got to the final part where I can say why am I doing a 7 to 7 challenge first time in my life. After mentioning all those big creators who were posting content on YouTube daily for years and compared to Charles Trippi who holds the Guinness World Record for the most consecutive daily vlogs uploaded to YouTube with more than 3000 videos, well my challenge will be pity. You know, I made this channel about three years ago and it gave me joy, happiness and a lot of good memories, but somehow I had no clue what to film in 2020. And even if I filmed something, I became a bit lazy and I became a bit lazy especially with editing. Before I would record my conclusions, let me try if my transitions and my b-roll skills are, are still there somewhere. Let's go. My healthy lifestyle might have to wait a bit more, but my videos on YouTube and TikTok, I hope I can put those on a different route. Because now I decided that I do not want to waste more time. Because my whole scope with the whole life is that I don't want to wake up one day old, no energy and realize that my whole life is gone. So this week I will do my 9 to 5 job, which is more like a 6 to 6 job, but whatever. Before, during the lunch and after, I will record, edit and post. So, see you in the next video. Bye-bye.